Hey everybody, welcome back. Today we're going to be talking about developing a great sound and control in our softer dynamics. So this is a challenge for a lot of brass players and understandably so. One of the first things we need to realize as we're going through this is that we're going to need a smaller aperture here. So when I say aperture, I'm talking about the little hole that the air comes out of. The reason why we're going to need a smaller aperture, maybe regardless of the range that we're in, is because we're going to have a smaller air column. To play softer, there will physically be less air passing through that aperture. As a result, a smaller aperture is needed to sustain that vibration. So here's how I recommend working on this. I recommend doing whatever passage you may have with a complete slur or gliss first. So here's an example of that. And then as you gradually get that softer and get more control, then add your articulations in, but keep that aperture small. Good luck.